Okay, I'm going to show you the um, quick method to calibrate the digital crosscut stop. So for the purposes of this discussion, I'm going to assume that you have made a test cut and measured it, and now you want to get the digital stop to agree to your measured value. Generally, I use a digital caliper to do the measurements. I cut a piece of stock about five inches long, and I measure that with a digital caliper, and then I want to program the stop to equal what I have measured with the caliper. So let's assume in this case that I cut this piece and I measured it, and it's exactly 5.25 inches. And the digital display is telling me it's 5, so clearly it's wrong and it needs to be recalibrated. So the way you do that is you enter a reference value, and you can do that in the programming mode, um, but the, there's a shortcut to the reference value, and that's this. You press and hold simultaneously the wrench button and the up arrow button. Now we're at the reference value parameter as though we had gone into programming mode, but this was the shortcut route to it. So in my uh, example, we've measured the piece to be 5.250. So let's enter that here. I'm going to scroll over and increment the digits here so we get to uh, 25. So now we have the right value, 5.250. Let's store that in the reference value by pressing this circle with the crosshatches through it. So now it's stored, and we can get out of this, this mode by pressing the wrench button again a couple of times. So um, now, as you can see, the, the stop reads 5.250. If it doesn't, if it still reads the original value, all you have to do is press and hold this circle button again with the crosshatch in it and that will bring the reference value into the display. Counts down 3, 2, 1, and bingo. There we have it. That's how you calibrate a stop to a measured value.